that's fine. It'll come up. Here we are We're with the fun. master, the cast that master Percy. We're going to show you how to catch some bumpers. Look stuff. at them in there. Look at them. They need the lessons. I am not going to sell somebody something. You got to be shown how to throw it. It's easy, oh, you're but right. it's best to take advantage of, the, of learning how to throw it. You, know, you teach people on grass. Of course, it holds the picture of what you're doing wrong. Mm -hmm. Start off. You can throw left or right handed. I'm throwing left handed. Uh, so the hand line will be in my right. Make small coils of it. This is the horn. Just lay it on top of the hand line. Run your hand down about four feet. Make about a two foot coil. Then your net up. And we've just taken a tremendous amount of pockets. And make sure all your sinkers are level. What you do is let your throwing hand drop down. Don't bend where it stops around your belt buckle. That's about three feet off the ground. Bring your hand down with the hand line and the horn. Lift the net up between your legs. Pick up the lead line and put it all over on the shoulder that has the hand line. down to the back of your wrist. That is the wrist of the throwing hand. Turn your hand over, keep your hand six, eight inches apart, and take the lead line and pinch it between your thumb and forefinger. Do not open your thumb and forefinger. Now we're ready to throw. Practicing on grass or on an AstroTurf field will hold a picture of how your net is responding to your throws. To load your net for throwing, gather the net into two two-foot coils and your final handhold should be at belt buckle height. To load the net, take a portion of the lead line and place it on the shoulder of the arm holding the netting and the hand line. Now, fan up to 50% of the netting onto your throwing shoulder. Once you have placed the 50% of the net on your shoulder, allow the net to slide down to your wrist. Grasp the netting with your pinky through your middle finger. Pinch the lead line with your thumb and index finger. This video demonstrates what it's like to throw a 10-foot radius net which opens up to a 20-foot circle. Remember to maintain your grip with your thumb and index finger all the way through the throw. With your arms straight out and your wrist approximately six to eight inches apart, rotate to the rear, which will load the net. Pull the net forward and when at the right angle, release the netting. Follow through with your throwing hand and the net will automatically be pulled from your thumb and index finger. Towards the end of the throw, the netting on your opposite shoulder will cause a delay which will help open the net. With very little effort and proper follow through, a Percy net will open fully, allowing you the opportunity for catching a net full of bunker. In the bunker world, it is referred to as one and done. With one throw, you have enough bunker to fish for the entire day, or as Percy says, it's one throw and away we go. That's good. No throw. 
Out of boy. Okay, we're loaded. What are we in? Uh, 42 feet in water. Yeah, there's so many of them. Like... Okay. They look pretty. Pretty, pretty. Just bring it up. You guys, that's it. Pull it out. There you go. That's all you have to do. Oh. Okay. Don't worry about those for you. I'm pretty confident we've got enough for a day of fishing. Maybe a couple of months. <laughs> all right. This is called Percy Cast Netting School. <laughs> Number one. Number one. <laughs> Take okay. one. Make uh, about two foot coils on the hand line till you reach the horn. Okay, what's the horn? The horn is that plastic ring is the that uh, connects the hand line to brails. It keeps the brails together. That looks good. We don't have to. Okay. It. You got so it. now you grab the horn. Now we got these lines in the top here. Right, so you're talking like 50% of the net is going to be up on my shoulder yes, now, you, right? You can go as far if you're a big, strong guy like you. Uh, get uh, you can take 60%. Yes. Yeah, take us to the promised land. Okay, okay, I think the net is I think clear. that's good. Okay. We're gonna let it drop down. We're gonna grab it. We're Give gonna... a little more off this time because you got a, you got extra weight in the front. Okay. We don't want this. Okay. Now, take control of the net. Your thumb okay, and forefinger pinch. Thumb pinch and this four here. Finger. Don't open this. And okay. Let me get out of your way. Now, which way you're throwing? I'm gonna throw just the same Passing. way you were. Okay. Good. Good. Yes, he went out much better. That was about as perfect as you're going to get, Percy. Yeah. A technique used for catching bunker is referred to as the rodeo. Simply put, this is beginning a slow circle with your boat around the bunker. Splashing or flipping is an indication there may be a good amount of bunker to be caught. Another way would be to watch your fish finder for an indication of a bunker school in the area. While the boat is circling, throw your net into the center of that circle and continue circling. This fast sinking Percy net will corral the bunker rapidly with an indication on your hand line. Feeling that vibration, also known as bunker love, will be an indication that you can immediately close the net. A large amount of bunker will prevent the net from sinking any further and will actually cause the net to rise to the surface as the bunker try to swim free of the net. This is also an indication that it is time to close up the net and bring in your bunkers to be loaded into your live well. A successful throw will yield many bunker causing you to be one and done. And as Percy says, one throw away you go. Okay, I feel tension feeling. in the line. I feel, I feel that we might have bunker. Do you have that feel? <laughs> I have that bunker. It's called the bunker love feel. Okay. Throw that line toward the rear, toward your son. We'll keep it out of the Look at that bunker love feel right there. Yeah. Keep that. Keep okay. Keep the braille. Let keep me get the this out of the way. All right. We're That's getting the it. lines cleared. Okay. And now. What do you think? Take Here we go. Uh, Bunker, thank you for the opportunity. We're releasing you. We're releasing these. This is just to show people how easy it is to get these bunkers. We're the Percy net. <laughs> there you go. All right. Bring it up. Okay. Now, see? Pull this up with the other hand. That's it. Huh? See, they'll rain out. They'll rain out. It's raining that, Bunker. Raining Bunker. That's it's it. raining Bunker. You know, once these guys get a hold of the net, they don't want to give it up. Yeah, we got it. Oh, I just saw a bluefish chasing. Yeah. Him. 
Lordy, Lordy, help me. <laughs> okay. You all set? Yeah. July 2nd. How many do you have? 60. I had about 30. We had, that's about 95. 90. 95 in one throw? Slow, Way to go. Man. I think you need to wash yourself off now. You're, you're a filthy mess. No, that's okay. <laughs> yeah, somebody has You know what borax does? It keeps the color. It won't fade. Uh, on the ocean, they make uh, water systems, even for small boats today. Mm -hmm. you know, one, you, you throw the handle one way, it's fresh water. The other way, it's... Nah. You know what happens is you, you just got to watch the shore. You put a lot of ice in it. It lowers yeah, the, the temperature, and you can freeze them. Yeah, yeah. In the ice? Yeah, it lowers it down to 20, 27 degrees. It'll freeze 28, it. I think. Yeah, something like that. You got enough crab bait till about 2017, right? Hi guys. Oh, that's bluff here. Bunk is all beautiful. Yeah, you got an opening up. Alright, uh, that should be good, right? Yeah, yeah, this is three bags. Oh, you do that. That's it. Close their eyes. I'll just leave it there. I'm going to swim him right in. Don't move nothing. Here he comes. Now, you got him. You got him. Beauty You're supposed to tell me to lift up on the net, Percy. Oh, that's it. All right, now, go ahead, lift him up. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's done. Oh, look Beauty. at that. Beauty. Woo! Lays work. Oh, yeah. I think that that's... That might be a keeper. I, maybe. I like... <laughs> I knew a super... Oh, Bob, they're jumping right out of the water. Yeah, we, Oh, God. Yeah, 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 it's I know. It's a pretty heavy fish, too. It's a nice fish. I do a All right, Bob, get that rod out of the way so I can take his picture. Okay, how's that? Oh, Beauty. Bert. Now, this time, look up at me, damn it. Cheese. One more. Cheese. All right, first, he's putting it up on the boga grip. What is it reaming? Is that the... Or or am I supposed all? to be able to tell? It might... I don't know. Okay, the boga grip. What's this? Looks like uh, 20, maybe 22 pounds.